Mastering English Phrases, Unpacking, Zip It Up. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we have an interesting phrase to explore. Zip it up. Now, this might sound a bit confusing at first, but don't worry, we're going to break it down together. By the end of this video, you'll understand exactly how and when to use this phrase in English conversations. So, let's get started. First, let's look at the literal meaning of zip it up. The verb zip refers to fastening something with a zipper, which is a device used for closing the edges of an opening of fabric or other flexible material. It is a pronoun that can refer to any object, item, or thing. And up is a direction that typically means from a lower position to a higher one. So, when you combine these words together, the literal meaning is to fasten something with a zipper in an upward direction. Now, let's move on to the more common, idiomatic usage of zip it up. In everyday English, when someone says zip it up, they are not usually talking about a zipper. Instead, they are telling someone to stop talking or to be quiet in a rather informal and sometimes brusque manner. It's a way of asking someone to keep their thoughts or comments to themselves. It's important to note that zip it up can be considered rude or impolite if used in the wrong context or with the wrong tone of voice. It's typically used in casual settings among friends or in situations where a direct or firm response is needed. However, it's not a phrase you would want to use in formal settings or with people you are not very familiar with. Let's go through a few examples to see how zip it up can be used in conversations. 1. Between friends. 2. A. I can't believe how badly I did on that test. 3. B. Yeah, you really didn't study at all. You spent all night playing video games. 4. A. Hey, zip it up. I'm already feeling bad about it. 5. In a movie setting. 6. Character 1. This plan is never going to work. We're all going to get caught. 7. Character 2. Zip it up and stay focused. We can't afford any negative talk right now. In both examples, zip it up is used to tell someone to stop talking or to keep their negative thoughts to themselves. And that's a wrap on zip it up. We've covered its literal meaning, its idiomatic usage, when to use it, and seen some examples in action. Remember, while it can be a useful phrase in casual and informal settings, it's important to use it carefully to avoid coming off as rude or disrespectful. We hope this video has helped clarify this interesting English phrase for you. If you have any questions or if there's another phrase you'd like us to explore, feel free to leave a comment below. Until next time, keep practicing your English and have a great day.